So, I mean, any, any of us can face dehydration if we're not careful about it. Um, so, I mean, I know there's, I'm super careful about it, but there's many times that I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so thirsty. And then I'm like, gosh, why am I thirsty? I have not been staying on top of it. So basically, you know, obviously dehydration is occurring when our body uses or loses more fluid than we're taking in. So you've got to be cognizant of that. And every day may be a little bit different depending on what you're doing. Um, we talked about the weather. We talked about exercise. All play major roles in it. Um, Anything to add to that? I mean, I feel like that was very streamlined about our signs and symptoms of dehydration. Yeah, yeah. And, you, you know, body composition is another one. So we talk about water compartments and, and things of that nature. You know, fat doesn't hold a whole lot of water. I don't know if it's 10% maybe, you know, whereas muscle has 75% water. I mean, so you're talking about a big swing from one individual to the next. Right. As far as water composition goes, um, you know, water content. and. You know, so like you said, there, there's medications and there's things and there's caffeine, there's alcohol. And not, not to say that they're truly dehydrating, because um, I don't think they are, but they can still, in a way, act as diuretics. And a lot of times that's, of course, the way that people will lose a lot of their sodium, too. Is So urine, of course, sweat, um, perspiration. No, perspiration is sweat. Respiration, just breathing. Um, one of the reasons why we wake up in the morning, first thing after eight or nine or 10 hours, whatever it is, sleep, you know, we've been sitting there just breathing, breathing something, right. you know, breathing it out. We're just not well hydrated. We haven't been consuming any fluid. So it's one of the reasons why we always preach that first thing in the morning. Let's get that glass, big, big, big jug of water down. So, yes. Yeah. No, there's going to be a great amount of content that comes out of this. And I'm probably sure we'll just, uh, we'll just scratch the surface, you know? There's right. It's a, it's a lot. It's Hydration's a, lot. a big topic. It is. Um, okay. So, Let's talk about hydration's impact on aging in the body. 